Wait, what are these for? Oh, yeah, we have two. Golly, I was thinking we were like, done? God, it sounds a little brighter than that. Wow, that actually helped. What's up, everybody? Another day, another YouTube video, another how-to. This time, it is a zippity fence which we ordered this fence off of Home Depot. I'm gonna put the link down in the description just in case you're looking for a fence or need one. This is a video that me and my girlfriend made of putting together the fence and uh, basically just what you do to put this fence together. It all kind of snaps together with a few screws, pretty simple, and then you just stick it into your ground. You don't gotta dig or anything like that. So uh, let's get to our video that we recorded yesterday, if you can give this video a like click that subscribe button down in the corner as well to see what else we have going on because I've been trying to have consistent content every week one two videos a week at least something so let's get to the video we're gonna get there eventually <laughs> what are these called again I dropped something I'm making a mess Zippity, that's it. Do it yourself friendly products. And this is a zippity, easy does it, ZP19001. It's one of those like white picket fences that everybody wants at their house. We needed three of them to keep that little monster over there inside the backyard. My goodness, shorts. The shorts were in the video. <laughs> So let's set these up. Where do we start? Where do we start? You're the unboxing master because you already put one together. Oh. And those are those caps that you said we weren't supposed to put on yet, right? Yep. So we don't put these on. Put these over here. There's two fences, so there's going to be four caps. Got it. You got it? Oh. So those are the little pieces. Oh, slats. Oh, we missed two slats. <laughs> Nothing else in the zippity box. All right, all right. Do we need the instructions, or are we good without? Good. Gosh, you're too smart. So is that a bottom piece? I think piece? that one will come in handy. That's the bottom, because... The slats go through. They don't go all the way through. Ah, uh, okay. So they stop. And then that's the top. And, and the top has the slats on both sides because it peeks through at the top of the fence. Makes sense. Because it'll look like that. See? So top, bottom. Totally makes sense. These are the ones that go in the ground. These are the stakes. Oh, they have names too? <laughs> I'm probably gonna get hated on on this video because you're like doing all the work, but. Does it like pop into place or you have to screw it in? No, you screw it in. Oh, okay, okay. Oh, I thought this was gonna be longer. We're not exactly matching like the holes. Gotcha, gotcha. So this hole lines up here, that one lines up there. Very, very simple. Okay, now I need a screwdriver. Oh, we need a screwdriver? Yeah, but it says you can use the electric one. Fancy. Alright, alright. How do you know which screw is which? I think we're, we might, you and I anyway, not part of this, but we'll use these so it's connected. to turn it, if yeah. we're going to turn it. Okay. Definitely. You need that. 
They're all yep. the same space. One size. Well, that just makes life simple. Mm-hmm. All right, sweet. Let's make sure this is lined up first, and then, yeah, let's put it in. Beautiful. Oh, whoa. So there's two screws on each, there's screws on each side? Yep. Well, that is overly complicated. That is not <laughs> necessary well, at all. <laughs> that makes sense. That actually totally makes sense. Now I don't feel that it says unnecessary. It just seemed already sturdy. It does have a fancy light, though. It does, yeah. I think it'll go through. There we go. Oh, it didn't stay like I thought it would. And so then these, wait, what are these for? Oh, yeah, we have two. Golly, I was thinking we were like done. I'm like, man, we're almost finished. <laughs> so these just literally slide through and clip in? Yep. Which you way do you? start with three, two, one, three, two, one. Just pops through. Yeah. Takes a and down to the next one. Okay. All right. Now we got like 10 more to do. So now we're putting the post in. The twos are in place. The threes are the tall ones or the ones are the tall ones? Ones are tall. So the ones are the tall ones. The ones go right beside each of the posts here. Followed by the twos that are a little shorter, and then next to those is the shortest. So that's all we got to do now. And then put together a whole second one. And two more over there. Beautiful. Then we just got to hammer it into the ground, and uh, then we take these little caps pop them on, hammer them in, pop them in really, and that's it. It's beautiful, baby. Yeah, baby, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, baby, yeah. All right, I guess let's do the next one. But these are pretty easy. Pretty sweet. I like it. And they're what, 70 bucks? For 10 feet? Mm -hmm. Not shabby. Five. Five still got to be put together. All right, let's do it. And well, that was uh, that was it. As you can see, a CC's truck behind me. I'm in Alpharetta. I'm at CC's getting a lunch because I just did some work for a client. I grabbed me a couple of slices of pizza and uh, then get back to my office. But that's the video. That's how you put the fence together. We did buy three of these. We have them on each side of our house to keep our dog in. And it honestly works amazing and once you do the first one you'll see that you can put them all together within really five to ten minutes it, it did not take long at all totally give it two thumbs up even though I don't have two thumbs and I must say I would buy more of them if I ever needed them for some reason there's a baby crying over there I'm gonna see you guys in the next video though click that like button if you can click subscribe down in the corner and we will see you next time deuces